Hi everyone, this is my um, one of my first videos on how to do immersion pickle. Um, so I was making this last week and a few people were asking me how do you make it and I thought well let me try making a little video while I was doing it at the same time and then you can kind of get the gist of um, what I did. So um, this is a, called a confit which in Mauritius is um, uh, like a confit, they're confit fruit, they're confit vegetables, things like green mangoes, uh, pineapples, ripe mangoes, olives, um, and sometimes they add tamarind and chili into that and they let it marinate in these massive jars and people sell them on the, on the streets, on the, on the roadsides and you can just stop the car and buy some and it's a great uh, afternoon snack or any time of the day really. So um, this is how you go about making it. So um, first of all I wanted to do a pineapple confit. So this, just using a normal pineapple, um, they have the small uh, Victoria pineapples and Mauritius that are super juicy and really tasty but um, in the UK you can just have the normal large pineapple that's fine that you find in the local supermarkets um, so I just literally chopped out all peeled the whole pineapple removed the little brown eyes on the side of the pineapple and um, using a knife just to do that but um, yeah be careful of your fingers with those little bits can be quite niggly but um, uh, what you do is you just want to chop them into small pieces, bite sized pieces I think is fine. I was doing this one for a canapé event so um, I wanted the pieces to be quite small but you can do um, large slices of pineapple that's fine. Um, so there's about one pineapple in this large kilner jar that I did and um, I think that was about enough. So you just you just chop them all up into small pieces and pop them in the jar. So that's kind of the first basic ingredient. And then to that, I'm going to add in some chilies. And uh, oh no, I'm not going to do chilies, <laughs> not yet. Anyway, this is the pickling um, juice, if you call it. So on the hob, what I did was I just got some brown normal brown sugar and just kind of melted it down with um, some water and um, added some vinegar in there so that becomes the pickling solution. Uh, you've got tamarind, you could add tamarind to it as well for a lovely sour note so that's great. And then um, I just uh, warmed it on the hob to make it uh, make sure the sugar dissolved well. Um, and then the next ingredient is to chop those red chilies in there, really nice hot bird's eye or Thai red chilies. Uh, you can leave them whole or you can just split them lengthways and pop them in, that's fine. Um, and then just literally just leave them to marinate in the sunshine uh, whenever we do have sunshine in the UK. If you're lucky enough to have sunshine that's great, otherwise on the windowsill for a bit and then just pop it into the fridge and keep it in there and there you go comfy pickles pineapple and you can do the same with mango um and it's great as a side or adding to any meal um do let me know if you try it at home